Okay, so this will be a quick one. I went to the library recently and I kind of went overboard. Uh, this always happens. I actually wanted to go there to return some books and then I decided to take a look around. Um, so I took a look around and then I found seven books. So uh, I think I may be overestimating myself because I only have a few more days of this holiday left and then like, it's back to the grind. But I just finished playing Undertale and I think like I am only left with two cities in Pokemon. So that means I will definitely have a bit more time to read. That is assuming I don't suddenly have work at the end of the week. But I will most likely have. Um, my to be read for the rest of the month is this pile over here. So the first is Death Sentences by Kawamata Chiaki Sad Cypress by Agatha Christie Bluebeard's First Wife by Ha Xiong Nan The Game by A.S. Bayer The Maids by Junichiro Tanizaki And this book uh, was lent to me by a friend Ten Mind Frames for Visible Learning by John Hattie, who's like a famous guy, and Klaus Zira. So, um, I'm not so sure how I'll be able to finish reading all of it, but I think that there is, I think that there's like two weeks left, so it seems possible because I mean, it's not like Agatha Christie is very hard to read and half of these books are not translated so I tend to mix up my reading a bit I'll read like translated, not translated, translated, not translated, translated so on and so forth so for my um, April to be read it's different okay so this is for April the Body in the Library by Agatha Christie This is a Miss Marple book uh, I kind of like Miss Marple I like how she's perceptive but also well-meaning and bumbling Another Miss Marple book 450 from Paddington It's a train mystery And then this is a Tommy and Tuppence mystery I haven't actually read any of the Tommy Tuppence mysteries so I thought this would be my foray into it By the Pricking of My Thumbs And then for non-Western literature, Miss Ice Cream Sandwich by Nieko Kawakami. I actually read her other book before, or like a couple of her other books before, so I have high expectations for this. And another is a... Breast and Eggs by Nieko Kawakami. And then this other book, the last one, for my intended April to be read. I keep seeing teenagers read it, so I was like, what's so interesting about it? Let's go and find out. Also because I recently found out that the third book for the Dandelion Dynasty series has been postponed to November. So um, I figured since there is so much time, it might be good to get into a different kind of uh, Chinese literature series. Legends of the Condor Heroes, A Hero Born by Jin Yong. This is book one. All the other books are not available, so it seems like fate. Okay, so that's my to be read. Yep, that's all. <laughs>